Welcome, and thank you for your interest in the safety of your coworkers and the traveling public by participating in this flag person training course. This training program was developed jointly by the Heavy Construction Safety Association of Saskatchewan, Inc., and the Saskatchewan Ministry of Highways and Infrastructure. It consists of six modules and is designed to ensure that flagging is carried out in a consistent manner. This course provides information about employer and employee responsibilities, equipment, clothing requirements, and practices and procedures. The information presented is intended for general roadwork activities. It addresses basic situations that arise in work zones. Changes in the work zone, such as traffic flow, work situations, and environmental conditions may dictate modifications as work progresses. Any changes to guidelines should always be fully discussed with the supervisor or traffic accommodation supervisor before they occur. This course has both theory and practical evaluation components. At the completion of this course, you will be issued a temporary flagging card. Your company will be required to complete a practical evaluation of your flagging skills as part of this course. In this first module, the legislation that gives you the authority and protection to do your job and defines the responsibility of the motorist will be discussed. Before we begin, let's review the learning objectives for this module. After completing this part of the course, you will be able to describe sections of the Traffic Safety Act and regulations that give you, the flag person, the authority to do your job, and describe sections of the Saskatchewan Employment Act and occupational health and safety regulations that provide protection for people working in construction zones. To move from one page to the next, use the arrows on the top right of your screen. Click the right arrow to move to the next screen and the left arrow if you want to go back to the previous screen.